Hi, I'm Nathan Garrison, co-founder of Shark Bands, and today we're here in beautiful Bimini, Bahamas to continue our technology in action series so that we can demonstrate to our customers just how well this product works. It's really important for us at Shark Bands to continue to test the technology, not only on new species, but in different scenarios as well. So we've enlisted the help of our friend Bernie to help us out with a little paddleboard test. Hi, I'm Dr. Patrick Rice, Senior Marine Biologist at Shark Defense Technologies. So Shark Bands utilizes very strong permanent magnets to repel sharks. These really strong permanent magnets actually override the shark's electrical sense, and that repels them. So the Shark Bands guys contacted me and said they've been getting a lot of questions from surfers all around the world about the effectiveness of Shark Bands, especially to protect them when their legs are dangling off the surfboard. So that's why we're here today, to simulate that scenario and see the effectiveness of the Shark Bands. We went out today to test the technology on a dummy, Bernie. Uh, basically, we placed Bernie on a paddleboard uh, with his leg hanging over with multiple shark bands tied to his leg. And the concept was to see if we could get the sharks attracted to the board and monitor their reactions to the shark bands. We chummed the water to bring the sharks to the surface. And when we did, the sharks had some very violent reactions to multiple shark bands on Bernie's leg. So based on the success of the first test that we did, uh, we decided to see at what level the shark bands were really effective. And so we removed all the shark bands except one. And then we even put bait inside the leg of Bernie and uh, put it back out to see what happened. And we had some really violent reactions as well. Look at him, look at him. He's going for it. They don't like that at all. They're getting frisky. Here they come. Oh, did you see that? So following that test, it's always really critical as a scientist to have a control. So we decided to see with all the shark bands removed and bait in the foot, would the sharks take a bite? So during that experiment, uh, the reactions were obviously different. The sharks were really attracted to Bernie's leg and they tore it to shreds. As you can see in the test today, shark have proven to deter sharks from the type of hit and run attacks that are most common with swimmers and surfers. More test videos are on the way, so keep up with us through our YouTube channel and Facebook page. And if you'd like to purchase the product, you can do so here at sharkbands.com. And we look forward to adding some peace of mind to all your ocean adventures.